This video shows how to perform stroke calibration and actuator pressure sensor calibration on StarPak 3 products using the keypad. The StarPak must be powered and the LCD display must be illuminated before you begin. Instrument air must also be supplied. Begin by removing the cover of the star pack by unscrewing it in a counterclockwise direction in order to access the keypad. Now select the F3 button to start a calibration. The system provides a warning that the star pack will now be taken offline. Be sure that before proceeding it is safe to do so. During the calibration, the valve will move and therefore it is critical to ensure process isolations are in place before proceeding. To begin, press F4 to accept. Next, the screen shows Analog Out 1 and 2 and Analog 1 calibration. Press F4 to move to the next screen. Now, select F2 to perform a quick cal. The star pack will confirm that the valve will open and close, and to proceed, click F4 to accept. The internal supply pressure level is required to calibrate the sensors correctly. When prompted, use the alphanumeric keypad to input the supply pressure. Note, it is important to ensure that the decimal is in the correct place when inputting the supply pressure. Once the value is correct, press F4. The plug-in stem will now move and the display will read, Calibrating Actuator, Please Wait. This process is the pressure sensor calibration. Once the calibration is complete, the display will change to Auto Stroke Cal, Please Wait, and then to Performing Auto-Tune Calculations. Once the calibration is complete, the screen will read, Calibrations Completed. Next, press F4 to accept the calibration. To exit the calibration menu, press the menu labeled Last Option twice on the left of the keypad to return fully to the main menu. The display will now read, System will be put online. Press F4 to accept and put the system back online. The star pack will now return to normal operating mode. For more information on this or other products, please contact your FlowServe representative.